Hello everyone, Blizzcraft here bringing you yet another episode and last time we left off we took a bit of shelter to wait for the rain to stop and uh, the rain eventually stopped so we can further continue our quest here in Darkshire performed well against the Shadow Weavers landmark, but even now, years after their first arrival, there seem to be so many to replace the ones we kill. I will put faith in Master Carvin, no doubt he will get to the bottom of the problem. Your previous accomplishments have convinced me that you are ready to take on the toughest worgen infesting the woods. Of the worgen that have made their new home here, the vile fangs and Titan ones have proven the most dangerous. They've settled down near some of the caves, some, some of the caves in, in the middle to the south. From, from far away you can even see the light from their bonfires. For the alliance. So much to do here in Dark Here. Splendid landmark. For your safe for your service to the people of Larkshire you shall be rewarded. There's even fowler and dead left to deal with Denmark. Tranquil Garden Cemetery further south of town is a place you don't want to be caught. In, at night. The bones that rise from the ground there are cunning enough to remember how to swing an axe or cast a spell. I shouldn't need to explain how dangerous that makes them. Proceed with caution. But remember the people of Darkshire that will suffer if you falter. Shall not falter. For the light is my strength. We should uh, probably go to the cathedral and pray. Need help? Since that you have seen being blind Mary, you have my calm. I can make a spool of ghost hair thread with this. And have a few strands to spare. Here are some coins for those extra strands. Here is your thread landmark. It has a thousand uses. From binding evil spirits to sewing life into inanimate objects. Light bless you. Uh, 
Ja. Alright then. We're gonna head off and follow. Follow the first clues. To our adventure. We need to get up this hill. Easy peasy. So dark here. It's ever so dark. My sword as danger lurks ahead. A worgen beast. We shall engage him. died there. But our quest is further ahead. Call <coughs> down the holy light to heal us. get to the objective
Light. Heal my wounds. Right, so we have but a limited amount, amount to sp of spells to cast before we can cast some more. <coughs> so we must be returning to the cathedral and pray to gain lights, uh, grace. And it seems there are more organs here. And the letters, pile of scraps, or whatever they are, it's there. So we shall take out another organ. Slash bundle of letters, which will return to dark here. To the honorable headmaster, Cridian, my former master, I write to you so that you might know that your apprentice has been doing that you might know what your apprentice has been doing of late. Paying heed to your advice, I sought to build my knowledge and wisdom through travel outside the gates of our beloved Stormwind. My journeys <coughs> took me to many places. But I have decided to take up residence here in the lovely town of Moonbrook. The surrounding fields of Westfall are most beautiful as the harvest approaches. Thank you for subscribing, I appreciate that. Right. Within just a few days of my visit, I found myself tutoring the local children from the nearby farmlands. The lesson went so well that the town mayor commissioned me to run a school and construction had begun on a brand new schoolhouse. For Silver Pine to Stormwind and now Mombrook, who would have suggested, who would have guessed I would see so much of Azeroth? Well, it's uh, 12 in the afternoon, you can hear the bell there, really creepy bell. Yep, really creepy. The worm regards Alvon Mismantle. Dear noble sir, word of your need of a tutor for your children has traveled to me here in Goldshire, where I take where I take up temporary residence in the Lions Pride Inn. 
Due to the unfortunate state of events in the region, I was forced to abandon my post as headmaster of the Moonbrook Schoolhouse. Please accept my application to serve as tutor for the offspring. Headmaster Crean of the Academy can speak to you of my abilities if necessary. I shall travel to meet you in person when the winter rains subside and the roads are suitable for travel once again. Until then, Stavo means mantle of silver pine. So this uh, Stalvan figure was a tutor. At least we know that much. Look, sir, I really don't want any trouble. By the light, you actually went and got it? I'm shocked. I suppose I owe you thanks for returning it to the archives. If you're that serious about this, I'll help you, then mark. I know where the other documents must be. I'm just too terrified to do anything about it. There's only a few places that those horrible night pain beasts gather the, when they're not growl, prowling the forest. One of them, the rotting orchard, orchard to the south. They use the buildings there as their dens, so if they haven't just eaten the other documents, you might find one there. But you'll have to search their lairs early, I wager. See you around. Alright, no sooner said than done. We're um, quite a few quests to do. But uh, that goes for another episode, so stay tuned for more. Remember to like this video if you like it, subscribe if you feel like it, and I'll see you guys next time.